We're in Seto, uh, which is my hometown, which is really weird being here. We were doing like a full production run through last night and, and every time I stepped out the door I got blown away by the bad weather and realised I was in, back in my hometown. <laughs> I can remember. <laughs> it's really weird. I walked in and the first thing I said, I dressed as a tree on that stage before. And, 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 and I can just remember like all these really weird things. Like we did a little, when I was very young I did a play and they basically put me in a cardboard box and told me I was a tree. I've got like loads of images of, 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 of being here when I was a kid, but it's often used for like, for cake sales and stuff, my TM, so our manager gave the woman a ring and said, oh, we want to come in and do a day's production early on, uh, a day before, is that possible? And she says, oh, I don't know, I'll have to move my cake so early. <laughs> and it's like, that is, that is this venue. Settle as a place, I think, is it's very quiet and, and and it's just a small town thing. It's like there's nothing here to do, and and it sends kids a little bit crazy, I think. But it's a stunning, stunning place. You really, really respect it for for being so quiet and for being so stunning, and 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 and, and generally for the people queuing to get on the bus and saying hello on the street, and just that that lovely mentality that you get. Um, but then it's also it's it's also it's got a small town kind of thing where Friday nights are for fighting almost because you can't go to cinemas, you can't do all so that sort of thing, but that's just the general small town vibe of things. I think seeing faces in the crowd that you recognise does... It's really weird. For example, I was at festival, right? And, and the last song I jumped off stage and started running up and down the crowd and I went to one point and ran down and, and when you stand on the steel fences and I jumped up at another one and the person that I jumped up in front of and kind of put my crotch in the face was my brother's ex-girlfriend and I was just there like, bye. <laughs> and it's just like, it's that feeling, right? It's, you also have, like, you're like, you have an alter ego almost on stage where you become John Newman and you kind of go for it and you, you switch off and you love the music and everything and the real world, not the real world but the world that you live in is kind of, it's there but it doesn't almost exist, it's all about that moment on stage, it's all about you on stage.